today we are going to learn chapter 3 domestic animals in this chapter we shall discuss about domestic animals and their uses let us begin the chapter there are some animals which depend on humans for its food, shelter and care. These animals are called domestic animals. The domestic animals are cow, donkey, hen, duck, sheep, goat etc. So domestic animals are animals which are present found along with the humans for its food, shelter and care. They are useful in many ways. Animals milk and its products. Animals like cow goat and buffalo gives us milk to drink. Milk is good for health. Milk can be converted into milk products such as butter, curd, cheese and ice creams. Butter, curd, Cheese and ice creams are milk products. Which animals gives us milk? Cow, goat and buffalo. Animals, eggs and meat. Some animals like hen and duck gives us eggs. Some animals like Hen, goat, crab, prawns and fish give us flesh or meat. So, which animals gives us eggs? Hen and duck. We eat the animal flesh of hen, goat, crab, prawns and fish. Fish Animals like goat, crab, prawn, hen gives us meat. Meat is nothing but a flesh of the animals. Animals, silk, wool and honey. Let us see which animals gives us silk, wool and honey. We get silk from silk worms. Silk worms are animals or insects which from which we get silk fabric we get wool from sheep's hair sheep's hair will give us wool we get honey and wax from honey bee and hive what are the uses of Pet animals. Parrots can copy as talking. They repeat what you say. Parrot is a pet animal. Dogs guard our homes from thieves. Dog is also a pet animal. Cats keep rats away from our house. Is it not? Yes. So cat is also a pet animal. So Pet animals also uses a, we use even pet animals help. We get help from the pet animals. Beast of burden. Beast of burden that is there are some animals which work hard for us at the farm. These animals are known as beasts of burden. 
what are the animals which works for us very hard donkey because it carries load for us horses elephants it carries log for us camel it carries us also bullock cart it carries packages of rice wheat from one village to another village or to the factory so these animals are called beast of burden the camel is called ship of the desert because it transports people from one place to another place horses draw a cart called tonga tonga is a cart of the horse oxen plow the fields for us so beast of burden animals are oxen horse donkey elephant camel and bullock animal skin which act as a leather which animal skin we use to make leathers skins of dead animals like cows buffaloes and camels are used as leathers so leather what is the use of leather we make bags shoes belt suitcases all these are made up of leathers from animal skin dead animal skins okay animals most will be cow buffalo and camels animal dung also can be used as manure and fuel dung of animals like cow buffalo horse camel is used to make manure and cooking okay the cooking has been still in use in villages cow dung has been used in villages even now let us have a chapter recap animal gives us useful things like milk leather silk wool and manure the camel is called the ship of the desert horses draw a cart called tonga oxen plow the fields dung of animals like cow buffalo horse camel is used to make manure and is used in cooking this ends our chapter 3